Come on. Oh no. Bro, that was fucked. Bro! Come on. Bro, I just snapped it, man. Fucking hell. That was nasty. Nice. Go on. How? Nice. Go, 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 go. Nice. Go, 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 go. Finally. Bro, that's just fucking ridiculous, man. Hey guys, what's going on? It's Captain America. Hope you guys are well and enjoyed the first part of this video. So hey guys, now Cold War is out. This is going to be my first video for Cold War. And honestly, I do have mixed reviews for the game coming from Modern Warfare to Cold War. Now, one of the main pros uh, in terms of the game is the gameplay. That's the only thing I do feel is... To the spec of what they had hoped for, um, the negatives being many things. The one thing that everyone knows is the, uh, is the skill based matchmaking, um, which is just horrendous in terms of Cold War. Every match that you go into is as if you're playing against pro players, which isn't ideal, especially if you just want to have a casual, laid back um, approach instead of fucking sweating every single time that you play. And to me, that's, that's not ideal, so they need to pipe that down. Second thing is, of course, being a sniper uh, myself, it is the ADS speed uh, within the snipers. It is a tad bit slow, so I do hope that they do buff the snipers within the next upload. I think it's going to be the updates on the 16th um, of December, so I'm hoping that, you know, there is some positives in terms of that. So looking forward to the snipers, but overall, um, the game does feel a bit more fast, I think, is because my um, the FOV for my screen is a bit more wider. I think it's 102 at the moment. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you my class setup for the Pennington, which is my main sniper that I've leveled up. The Tundra is another sniper. Still leveling, leveling it up. It is on level 18, but that's my next sniper that I am leveling. Um, so the Pennington is the main weapon I use within this video uh, for the sniper side of things. And I'll show you the class setups that I have. Um, I'll show you things that you can replace it with. Um, if you want to go with the alternative, both do work out really well and I would recommend one or the other, okay? So the first thing that we have is the optic. Now, I've got the Hangman RF, which for me is very ideal. It is very similar to more of a Modern Warfare type of style. Um, in terms of the aiming, it is much more faster, I do feel, in terms of the ADS speed. You can remove that completely if you do wish to just have the generic optic, which is a very similar style to Modern Warfare. Now, let's keep that before I bloody forget. Um, the next one is the muzzle, which is the stabilizer 3.08, which again does help out with the sway control. It does minimize that. Um, the barrel, you have to go with the 26.5 inch Tiger team. Uh, yes, you have to level it up. It's going to be the, the most bottom and the last thing that you have to level up. But the attachments or the pros that you do get with it are just phenomenal. You know, the reload speed, uh, the damage is plus 20%. The fire rate too, as well as the bullet velocity does go for the long range uh, enemies, let's say. 
And in a magazine, you would need the seven round, especially with a lot of the times when you do use a sniper's ear as a hit marker machine. So I would recommend the seven rounds. And then you've got the handle, which is the airborne elastic. Again, it does help out with the aim down speed, the ADS going, the zooming in much more faster, as well as the flinch resistance. And that's it really, guys. Um, please do subscribe if you are new to the channel. We are so close to 200 subscribers. We are currently on 194, so close to the target. So if you did enjoy the video, hit the like button. But yeah, overall, I'll catch you guys in the next video. I am going to be trying out the AK-74U, which is a bit... It is an overpowered gun, so yeah, so that's going to be the next um, weapon I'll show on my next video. But overall, enjoy the next video, and I'll catch you guys soon. Bye-bye. Okay, let's go. Let's do this shit, man. Fucking hell, this fucking shitty-ass fucking map. Fuck off, mate. With my fucking level fucking low on this gun. Why isn't my fucking player running, man? Come on. The most campiest fucking map I've ever come across, man. It's the most shittiest map that they've uh, updated and uploaded. Fuck your dad's a bitch. How do you like me nice? Pellington's alright man. I heard that they're gonna be... What the fuck? I heard that they're gonna be... Two seconds. As for me, the PP-19 Bison on Modern Warfare is hands down the best gun I have ever used in my entire life man. That was such a good gun man. And I miss it so much that I won't be able to use it again. Well, here's the math question. It takes me 10 bullets to kill anyone, and I die in two bullets. Trust me, I'm the same. Look at this knife guy. Look at this knife guy. Fucking one knife. Yeah, I'll get a hit marker with a sniper. Fucking, that's such a dumb game, man, honestly. Look at this. There's something is broken. <laughs> Fucking, the whole game is broken, bro. Such a shit game. And how the fuck am I supposed to play at this fucking night time, man? What the fuck? Bro, me and this person are so fucking shit. So fucking shit this game is, man. Honestly, what the fuck? I don't understand why I can't fucking do a melee fucking bullshit fucking shit. Fucking every single time doesn't move. It fucking stops like a little bitch, man. That guy's been up there, Christy, man.
normal, man.